two outstanding front courts. Go. What makes for an effective big tandem, you think? I think the best combos complement each other's talents. Also, they play off one another. On offense, one can go inside, one can go outside. And on the defensive end, if you have both guys that are interchangeable and can guard multiple positions, that's what makes it great. And a look at the starters for the Bulls. Ball and Levine make up the backcourt. Nikola Vucevic is out there with Patrick Williams. And it's DeRozan in at the three slot. Now here's Tatum. Outside, Williams. Pass to Smart. Tipped. Levine with a steal. Over Smart. And they cash it in right away with a quick shot. And now the game is really starting to flow. We should be in for a good one. How good is it to see the first one go through the net? Here's Williams. And here's Smart. He's covered by Levine. Oh, it's blocked by Levine. First quarter, just over a minute played. Brown with the steal. Pass to Smart. Stolen by Ball. Now here's Vucevic. Over Williams. Orford pulls it in. Brown against Levine. Tatum with it. Over to Rosen. Zach Levine clears it away. Brown against DeRozan. Pass to ball. It's stolen by Smart. Fires the three. Buries it from three. You don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Ball outside. Here's DeRozan. And the first quarter of action, two minutes in. That one goes in. Wow, inside, in traffic. DeRozan being very aggressive. Pass to Williams. Smart with the ball. He's covered by Levine. From inside. Smart with the bucket. Getting it done inside. Smart has got five points. Too easy for a guy of his caliber. The D must put up more of a fight down there. And you have other methods as well. You could deny or you can just front the post. Now here's Ball. To the middle. Brown with the steal. The drive by Tatum. And finished off by Tatum. The speed of Tatum's drive makes it so tough to defend. You just don't get a chance to stop him. Ball passes to DeRozan. The 11-footer, not going to go that time. Tatum with some nice D. And we talk about veterans adding to their games. DeRozan has become an excellent facilitator, something he really takes pride in. Now here's Smart. He's got five. Missed inside. What a defensive play. Gets the stop and does it without fouling. Levine finds Vucevic. And here is DeRozan. Vucevic, a screen on Tatum. Here's DeRozan. And it falls. Two for three from the field so far. And DeRozan typically makes the simple pass over the flashy one. That's his style across the board. You won't see him on a ton of highlight reels for his passing. But he's about making the right play within the flow of the game. Now you want to get him going as soon as possible. Great way for him to start this game. And we know once he gets in the rhythm, he's a really tough guy to stop. Now here's DeRozan. Tatum with a steal. Pass to Smart. Driving to the basket. Here's Williams. Somehow scores the layup in traffic. All right, let's take a look at the energy stats. How the hustle game has been going for the Celtics. Their aggressiveness on D has been the most glaring aspect of this game so far. They have the heat turned all the way up in this first half. They're also jumping on a lot of turnovers and making sure they turn them into points at the other end. Now here's Brown. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Pass to Horford. The three. And it's cleared by Vucevic. For Chicago, they've gone three of six since the tip. Inside, here's Williams. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. 
I don't mind that. I mean, they met him at the rim and temporarily prevented the points. Free throw drops for Williams. That one misses. And over his career, Grant, Al Horford has continued to improve his outside shot. Well, he really has. He came into the league as a low block bruiser. Eight years in, he adjusted and added a three-point shot, and he has been a reliable player from outside since then. And Jalen Brown gets a whistle that time. That'll be a second foul of the game. And now another look at that mobile one block defensive performance. <laughs> what a play. I mean, that'll have the offense thinking twice about taking shots in his presence. Here's Vucevic. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Picked by Vucevic. Ball passes to Vucevic. Count it. It's no secret that Lonzo is an elite facilitator. If you're open, he will get you the ball. Smart against Levine. Pass to Horford. Williams, a screen on Williams. Boston again missing. Chicago trailing here. Ball with it. Outside Levine. Back to ball. Six to shoot. Williams passes to Levine. Oh, that doesn't go on the chance to tie. Ball against Brown. Pass to Smart. Williams a screen on Levine. On the drive, Smart. And the layup is good off the glass. Smart has got seven points. And credit his teammates for feeding him all quarter. The Celtics making a switch here. Gallinari's checked in. Desumu, he's checked in for Chicago. Side. Outside Levine launches a three. The rebound, Celtics. Great perimeter D gave a good shooter absolutely no room to operate. And Williams gets the bucket on the assist from Smart. And now a seven point Celtic lead. 
Ball outside. Outside Levine. Vucevic, a screen on Smart. Pass to Vucevic. Just four to shoot. Here's the soon move. That one a little long. He looked just a little out of rhythm. He's still trying to establish consistency from there. Right side, Gallinari. Smart, outside. Now here's Tatum. Fires from deep. Fires in the triple. Tatum's got eight. And they're behind right now because they're failing to play quality defense. It's that simple. Ball passes to Levine. Pass to Vucevic. Over Williams. Vucevic's shot is off. Off the mark once again. Terrible quarter for him thus far. Now Smart. He has seven. Now here's Brown. Into the lane. Paddles through traffic and lays it in. What a way to begin this game. Dominating at both ends of the floor. They came in prepared, focused, and really jumped on the other team early. Boston has gone three for five from deep so far in this matchup. Pass to Smart. Right wing. Gallinari inside. Williams defending. It's good. And he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point play opportunity. When you look back at the 2010s, we had some monster trades in the NBA. Danilo Gallinari was part of two of them. First in 2011, he was sent from New York to Denver in the Carmelo Anthony deal. Horford, he's checked in for Boston. White comes in for Jalen Brown. That's good from Gallinari. And the second major deal Gallo was a part of. Smitty, the trade sending Paul George from OKC to the Clippers. Yeah, it was Gallo and SGA. Five first-round picks going from the Clips to the Thunder back in 2019. We keep seeing Danilo moved in these blockbuster trades because he's a unique talent at 6'10 with a shooting ability out this world. And it's the Bulls with the ball. 15-point game. Here's Levine. Banked it in off the glass. Levine's got his second basket of the game. What body control from Zach Levine. Terrific at keeping his composure even while under pressure. Here's Smart. Out to Horford. Fires the three. Rebound by the Bulls. Vucevic has got five rebounds tonight. Pass to DeRozan. Over Tatum. And it's DeRozan missing. Hard to create space in that mid-range area. He would have been better passing that off. Horford, a screen on DeRozan. Tatum from long range. And it's to Sunmu with a rebound. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. DeRozan with the ball. Picked up by Tatum. And the whistle on the shot. Got some contact there. Misses the shot, but he'll shoot two. Make him foul you to stop you. DeRozan with the strength and vertical ability doing damage inside. Two shots. Last on the first. First free throw is good. 
and defying the analytics trend, DeRozan's favorite shot still remains the mid-range jumper. I mean, they've tried to stretch him out with uneven results. Maybe better to surround him with three-point shooters, create space in the medium range area to maximize his effectiveness. DeRozan hits them both. We've seen him put a lot of pressure on the defense and then cash in at the line. Pass to Gallinari. Horford, a screen on Levine. Gallinari for three. Here's Horford. Uses the glass to finish the layup. And now, almost all their points coming from the paint. Levine against Smart. Picked by Vucevic. Here's Levine for three. Drains the triple. Levine's got seven points in the game. Boy, there's a certain beauty to that high-arching jumper. Levine showing us the range. Horford passes to Gallinari. Takes it inside. And it's cleared by Vucevic. Vucevic has got six rebounds now in the game. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. And the call will be against Jason Tatum. That's his first foul. That's something you hate. You're trying to come in with an aggressive mindset, and that early foul could take you right out of it. Green's checked in for Zach Levine. And so here is Chicago, trailing by 10. White against Smart. Pass to DeSumo. Just five on the clock. The three is up. Chicago with a three. Terrific play. This is why you run your offense through him and live with the results. On the drive. Smart. Can't hit that one. Now Chicago takes it the other way. 46 seconds left in the opening quarter. Vucevic from down in the low post. It goes. Now just a five-point Boston lead. He was able to simply lay it in over the top of the smaller man. Outside Tatum. Horford, a screen on DeRozan. Tatum with it, guarded by Vucevic. A nice shot by Tatum. And there's really no such thing as a safe lead. I mean, this is still anyone's game. Just two seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. And here is DeRozan. Vucevic, a screen on Tatum. Oh, oh, wow. no second. oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. Incredible leaper, explosive finisher DeRozan with one of his acrobatic dunks. And so it's Jason Tatum making highlights for Boston. He put together 10 points in the quarter. More NBA on 2K Sports right after this. For those of you just tuning in, second quarter action is where we are. And for the Celtics here, guys, what jumps out to you stat-wise? Well, there's no reason to take risky shots when you can collect points at the rim. Especially at the start. You want to get something positive going and establish your rhythm. Celtics with the lead. Malcolm Brogdon out there with Derek White. Then it's Jalen Brown. Then there's Robert Williams. And it's Williams in at the four. That's the Boston Five. <laughs> Slams it down with two hands. Man, they're really getting aggressive now. Drummond, the screen on Williams. DeRozan with the ball. Now guarded by White. Here's Drummond. And it's in there. Drummond's got his first bucket in this one. And they had early success from the perimeter, but I don't understand how they've gotten away from that here in the second. 
Williams has screened on the beam. Here's Brown. Oh, and a dunk by Brown! Wow, that type of finish is just deflating right now for a team that's trying to make a comeback. Ouch. That's certainly a big-time finish right there. It was one big exclamation point, or maybe even a question mark. DeRozan. And they're going to count that bucket, and they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. And in crunch time, when the game is close, some players rise to the occasion, Smitty. Others tighten up. What do you think makes the difference? Well, first of all, a lot of it is confidence. But I think also you got to trust in your preparation. And a lot of guys are built for the moment, and some are not. And most of the guys built for the moment, they are superstars. That's good from DeRozan. The ninth pick in 2009, DeRozan was part of a great draft class. Griffin, Harden, and Curry all included. It's White with a drive. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. I like their mindset. Staring at a deficit, they're pounding it inside for high-quality shots. And you talk to anyone about White. Grant, they'll tell you, he's best when he's being What's assertive. That? I totally agree. I mean, White can be caught standing around when he's not involved. You want him initiating and pick and roll, and he makes pretty good decisions. Now, he may never be a star, but he's going to give you solid minutes. And that one misses. A tremendous on-ball defender, Derek White. He makes life easier for his coach with his physicality and willingness to take charges. The Celtics have gone three of three to begin the second. A chance here to catch up with Alley from the sideline. Thanks, Brian. Well, Zach Levine with his first All-Star selection in 2021, and then the Bulls added a second All-Star, Nikola Vucevic, at the trade deadline. Levine said, we got another big-time player here. Guys, with this combination, they have a chance to be special. Well, they're putting some pieces together, Alley. Thanks for that. Four on the clock. Here's White. And the layup falls. And another area where White helps the club defensively is in transition. It's because he's good athletically, understands where he needs to be, and when he's aggressive, B.A., and 100% focused, this team gets a lot more stops. All he needed was a little separation. So effective. Or cleared the path, put him in position for a prime-time dunk. That's a big-time move and a big-time finish. Drummond, the screen on Brown. Here's Levine. Here's Drummond. Uses the glass on the layup. Drummond's got four points in the quarter. I mean, a great decision by Zach Levine. Could have forced one up, but he's trying to keep his teammates involved. Outside White. Puts one up from 19. Rebound by the Bulls. The battle of the boards has been something to watch. Pass to White. Now Drummond. Here's Levine. DeRozan outside. The Bulls need to get off a shot. Caruso misses for Boston. They've gone four for six here in the second. Outside White. Pass to Brogdon. Takes the three. DeRozan with the rebound. DeRozan's got four rebounds now. Drummond to screen on Brogdon. It's DeRozan with a drive. And the dunk by DeRozan. That's what I like to see from DeMar DeRozan. He isn't selling for a jumper. He is going to the rim today. Here's Brown. Williams has screen on Levine. Brown. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. It's going to go on Andre Drummond. Great job drawing the foul and almost converted the shot as well. Shooting two. throw good. Brown. Wow. 
And both free throws good for Brown. Here's Levine. Seven points in the game. DeRozan, a screen on Brown. Let's it fly. That went off the back iron and out. And for Boston, they're shooting a nice 57% rate from the field in the second quarter. Here's Williams. And terrific work on the offensive glass as he picks up the deuce. Salvage the possession. He's a terrific offensive rebounder. Some changes for Chicago. Jones, he's checked in for DeMar DeRozan. And Green is subbed in for Zach Levine. White, the pass to Green. Outside White. Pass to Caruso. Back to White. Six on the shot clock. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. For Boston, they've gotten over 50% of their shots to go. Five for nine in the second. Brogdon, the pass to Williams. It's stolen by Drummond. Pass to Green. Poke loose. And so the ball out of bounds. Brown touched it last. Here's Caruso. He's guarded by White. Oh, it's blocked by Williams. Brogdon, the pass to Brown. Williams, a screen on Green. Down low. And Williams punches it home. Explosive leaping ability allows him to play the five, even though he's a little undersized. Pass to Jones. A nice way to start. Makes his first one. That's a well-timed, well-coordinated play. Comes right off the pick for the lay-in. Brown with it. Three-pointer. Caruso grabs the board. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. White, the pass to Green. Now Drummond. Williams defending. With a nine-footer, Williams grabs the board. The Celtics have gone six of 11 here in the second quarter. Here's Brown. Sinks that one from the post. Brown's got eight points. Brown taking on all challengers. This kind of fearless approach is what his teammates and coaches love seeing. White for three. That shot off the mark. Now Boston takes it the other way. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. White, the pass to Brogdon. Williams, a screen on White. Inside. And Williams gets the bucket on the assist by Brogdon. And now it's a 10-point Celtic lead. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Pass to Jones. White on the wing, guarded by Brogdon. Drummond, the screen on Brogdon. Shot clock at five. They get it back. They shoot again. The shot by Drummond, no good. Out of character for him to miss that shot. Maybe just a little too casual there. And here's White. Pass to Williams. Two points. That one goes. They have no answer defensively inside. Chicago has gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Now here's White, guarded by Brogdon. Now here's Green. Shakes off strong D and gets to the bucket for two points. Like seeing Kobe White create for others. He's so unselfish and has a great feel for the game.
And some changes here for the Celtics. Horford, he's checked in for Williams. Tatum comes in for Williams. And Smart subbed in for White. Tatum against DeRozan. Here's Horford. And it comes off the front of the rim. And for the Bulls, they're shooting just around 39% in the second quarter. Out to the right wing. Brown with the steal. Now the Celtics on the move. Here's Smart. Tipped. Ball with it. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. DeRozan against Tatum. And Jalen Brown gets a whistle that time. That's his third foul so far. And that's the risk you run when you leave him in with two fouls. Brown against Ball. Pass to Vucevic. Nice D from Horford. The Celtics on offense. They're on a 12-4 run. Nails the baby hook. And the Celtics lead by 12. That's 10 straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. It's stolen by Smart. Shoots over Levine. And it's Smart missing. It's amazing. All night he's been out of sync on the offensive end. Yet they continue to lead. Vucevic against Horford. Charity stripe shot. Ooh, rejected by Horford. The great positioning. The 7-1 wingspan. That combination makes Horford a dangerous shot blocker. Outside Tatum. The shot. And it's Brogdon missing. With the defense absent, that was a great opportunity, but no go. Outside Levine from the arc. Boston with a rebound. Vucevic count the basket. Vucevic has got six. Well, Vucevic has finished a couple times in the top ten of offensive boards, in part because of his feel for the game. And here's Brown for three. And it's cleared by Vucevic. Vucevic has got the glass covered here tonight. That's 11 boards for him. Pass to Desumu. Here he goes. Over Brogdon. No good there. That would have cut it to single digits. Boston's gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Out to the right wing. Fires at the elbow. Here's Horford. And he banks in the layup. Six points for him. The value of a big man with Horford's quickness can't be overstated. He takes full advantage of the rebound opportunity. Levine against Smart. Ball outside. Five to shoot. Back to Vucevic. Off target with the three. Austin on offense. They're on a 16-6 run. Brown passes to Smart. Knocked away. Now Brogdon. Now Smart. Horford a screen on Vucevic. Tatum from long range. It's hauled in by the Bulls. Vucevic has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Started out strong from three-point land. Hit two in the first quarter, but he's gone dry since. Vucevic, a screen on Tatum. Pass to DeRozan. To the middle. And it's Vucevic. That time on the assist by DeRozan. Vucevic has got four points in the quarter. And so it's Boston earning this break in the action up 10 and it's all due to their ability to own the paint they've been dominant down low we'll be right back after this word
if you just join it in. One half is in the books. One half to go. You know, DeMar DeRozan has been exceptional here, guys. The numbers say it all. He spent the first half playing efficient ball. And it's not like everything's been at the rim. There's been a number of jump shots along the way. And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. And so in the game for the Bulls, Ball and Levine make up the backcourt. Patrick Williams out there with DeMar DeRozan. And it's Vucevic in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Back to Williams. Outside Tatum. Williams, a screen on DeRozan. Just five to shoot. There's Tatum with the three. Knocks down the triple. Tatum's got 13. Going into his role as a franchise player, Tatum with a huge game. It's been so much fun watching him tonight. DeRozan against Tatum. There's Ball with a three. Tatum pulls it in. Tatum's got five rebounds in the game. Pass to Brown. Horford, a screen on Ball. Brown can't hit. And that's okay. Even though you miss, you had the right guy taking the shot. Tatum against Ball. Here's Vucevic. Rebound Boston. Smart finds Tatum. Smart with the ball. Parted now by Williams. Horford, a screen on Levine. Tatum from long range. DeRozan with the rebound. The Bulls shooting 40% from the field in this one. On the wing, Levine. Yes, great play by DeRozan to set him up. DeRozan's got three assists in the game. Woo, Zach barely gave the defense a chance there. He quickly gets the shot in the air. Tatum against DeRozan. Let's it fly. Austin again missing. The Bulls have gone just one of three in the second half to the paint. Ooh, rejected by Horford. Brown inside, rounded by Ball. A nice shot by Brown. He's got 10. And this is what you want to do when you've got a big lead. You must stay aggressive. I'm impressed with their intensity tonight. They came in focused and they executed. For Boston, they've gone 2 of 5 in this third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes gone by in the second half. The shot comes out. Good work defensively by DeRozan. One thing you gotta love about Nikola Vucevic is that on offense, he does it all. For big, he's got a terrific three-point shot, and of course, he regularly posts big point totals. Pass to Vucevic. And his fifth make of the game in 12 attempts. This is Vucevic's comfort zone. Even when the D is good, his offense is sometimes just better. Well, there's no denying that Vucevic's offensive output really makes him a great example of a modern big. Yeah, his abilities at long range definitely help stretch the floor. But he can also be an old-school menace down low, gobbling up rebounds and owning the paint. Levine passes to Vucevic. Pass to DeRozan. Outside Levine. Smart against Vucevic. Outside, Williams. Back to Vucevic. From deep. And again, it's the Bulls from deep. The sure stroke of Vucevic when he added that three-point shot in his sixth season. He has loads of trust in his jumper. Smart with the ball. Picked up by DeRozan. Outside Tatum. This one for three. Knocks down the long J. Tatum's got 16 points. He's hit a pair of threes each half, making a significant impact. Up top, Levine. Defended by Smart. The shot is good by Levine. Levine's got five points now in the quarter. The question for Zach Levine coming in, will he get strong enough? There's your answer. And the call will be against Jason Tatum. That'll be a second foul of the game. And this kind of selflessness is great to see. Textbook positioning to draw the charge. 
And I'm glad we got to see the mobile one block once more. What a play. You know, you can't ask for any better defense than that. He responded so fast to the shooter, and it stifled him. Ball passes to Williams. Here's Vucevic. Williams defending. Vucevic draws the double. The three from Ball. That one falls. Coming off the Vucevic feed. Ball's gotten himself going with a triple. His first basket of the game. Tatum against DeRozan. And Tatum, here we go. And finished by Tatum. Wow! And we don't always get to see this from Tatum. Adding the sizzle to the stake. There's the drive. And the whistle blows as the basket counts. Chance at a three-point opportunity here. One free throw coming up. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Celtics. One thing that stood out all game is the consistent penetration they've gotten. They've also worked very hard to get the ball inside and have been able One to shot. get and hit a lot of high percentage shots in this game. Levine, no good on the free throw. Defenses pay a lot of attention to Zach Levine because he can attack from anywhere in the half court, a player you can't lose track of. He didn't have his feet planted. And Boston has possession. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Smart passes to Tatum. Williams, a screen on DeRozan. Six to shoot. Here's Tatum. Again, Boston. And with Levine and the attention he garners, it opens up his teammates. B.A., Zach Levine has improved in that regard. When his teammates are open, he swings it right on time. His IQ on the offensive side has gone way up. Ball passes to Williams. And there's the drive. And the foul is called. He missed it. So he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. That's on Al Horford. <laughs> Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. Shooting two. And he knocks down the first one. Gallinari, he's checked in for Horford. And the Bulls also making a change. Desumu, he's checked in for DeRozan. So he picks up just one from the line that time. Boston has gotten two of four threes to fall here in this third quarter. And it's smart missing. Chicago has gone three of four from outside in the second half. Levine passes to Ball. Pass to Desumu. Shoots over Tatum. Desumu can't hit. Very surprising. He gets the ball where he wants it in a decent matchup. Now here's Brown. Ten points for him. Over ball, it's tipped. When you mix ball's length with this timing, the result is a quality defensive play. This could be a problem. That's his fourth foul with plenty of basketball left to play. And it's the Bulls with the ball. Eight-point game. Ball passes to Vucevic. To the inside, Williams. And Williams punches it home. He put a little flair on that one. Yes, he did. Man, he's a strong finisher, huh? Tatum with it. Guarded now by Ball. And here's Brown for three. And the shot is good on the assist by Tatum. Brown's got five points in the quarter. Draining his first three of the game. No doubt hoping to build up a little momentum from outside. And Robert Williams picks up the foul. That's foul number two for him. The Bulls making a switch here. White's checked in. Oh. 
Williams on the wing. He's covered by Gallinari. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Everyone in the building saw the obvious contact. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. One falls for him. And he makes both free throws. The Celtics have gotten seven of 14 attempts to fall in the half. Outside, Williams. Pass to Smart. Outside, Brown. Five on the clock. Williams with the screen. Brown passes to Williams. And Williams punches it home. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, B.A. Hey, little exclamation point. Vucevic, a screen on Smart. Here's Levine. Oh, they oh, 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 the creativity, extreme athleticism. You see why Zach's won the dunk contest multiple times. And here's Tatum. Give him 20. Takes it inside. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Tatum's got 12 points here in the second half. Man, he has been locked in this quarter. Shouldering the load at the offensive end. And there's the foul. It's on Zach Levine. That's his first foul. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. And some changes here for the Celtics. Horford, he's checked in for Williams. And Malcolm Brogdon is subbed in for Smart. DeMar DeRozan's checked in for Chicago. Horford, a screen on White. Brogdon from outside, and it's cleared by Vucevic. Vucevic has got his 16th rebound on the night is the glass on the layup. White's got his second basket. Terrific play in the paint by Kobe White. Uses his athleticism to find a shot. Pass to Gallinari. Horford outside. Here's Brown. The three is up. Count it. That's his sixth field goal in 12 tries. Here we go. His second bay from beyond the arc in the second half after having no such luck in the first. Green's checked in for Chicago. Free throw, no good for Brown. Chicago has gone three of four from outside in the second half. Masumu can't hit. Boston has got four of eight attempts to fall from deep here in the third quarter. Brogdon against White. Now here's Tatum. Not a lot of room to the paint. Here's Horford. And the shot is good on the assist by Tatum. Horford's got eight points. Pure physical ability gives Horford the advantage. The defense couldn't hold him down. Vucevic finds White. Vucevic, a screen on Brogdon. White for three. Rebounded by the Celtics. Horford's got eight rebounds in the game. Here's Brogdon. Using his post moves to get the two points. And the Celtics lead by 14. 143 left in the third quarter. On the wing, Green. Pass to Vucevic. They need this. And the power finished by Vucevic. And what an aggressive move to the rim. He's really trying to fire up his teammates right now. Boy, it's not hard to feel inspired after a teammate makes that kind of finish. The problem is your opponent is making big plays as well. I'll be curious to see the response. White, the pass to DeRozan. 
Vucevic, a screen on Tatum. Here's DeRozan. Pass to Vucevic. That one falls. Vucevic has got nine points now in the second half. And for the Celtics, they're shooting 53%. Good efficiency on offense so far. Horford, a screen on White. Outside, Brown. Driving inside. Horford outside. Vucevic with a steal. And now the Bulls in transition. DeRozan with the ball. Picked up by Gallinari. And there's White. That's good on the assist by DeRozan. DeRozan's got his fifth assist in this one. Tatum against DeRozan. Tatum passes to Brogdon. Tatum inside. A strong finish under heavy pressure from the D. Tatum's got 24 points. This has been a tremendous quarter for him. Everything he puts up now looks like it's going in. Pass to Horford. And here's Brown. The three. The shot that time not on target. Well, through three quarters of play, down double digits. It may be difficult to overcome. Celtics out in front. They lead by 13. And we're coming right back after this break to get the fourth quarter started. And let's take this opportunity to show you our State Farm assist to the game. Now, I know he's a big man, but he's got some point guard in him if he's making passes like this. Let me tell you, when you can run offense through your bigs, you give the defense just another thing it has to try and take away. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. Danilo Gallinari out there with Robert Williams. Then it's Derek White. Then there's Marcus Smart. And it's Williams in at the three spot. That's who's in the game for the Celtics. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. Pass to Gallinari. And there's the foul. It'll go on DeMar DeRozan. That's foul number two for him. Yeah, he tried to gain position, but couldn't quite get there. Williams finds Williams. And here's Smart. He's guarded by White. Shot clock at six. Outside White. No good with the triple. Well, the Bulls shooting about 48% from the floor. Pretty good. Pass to Drummond. Here's Caruso. That three's off the mark. It's so hard to keep the defense honest when you miss wide open looks like that. Now, here's Williams. Here's Gallinari. A shot from the mid-range. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. Trying to close out. You gotta know who's hot and who's not. Levine against Williams. Drummond up top. Fires the three. Oh, my. Came close to a four-point play. He'll head to the line for three free throws. That one on white. Hey, <laughs> nice work attracting the foul from deep. He'll shoot three. Three shots. Three shots. And he's good on the first of three. no good. They're missing a chance to trim the lead by leaving points at the line. And 
and he nails the third. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth. Smart passes to Gallinari. Back to Smart. Outside White. Off target from outside. The Bulls shooting about 47%. A nice number. White against Smart. White, the pass to Levine. Here's DeRozan. Outside White. And again, Chicago, no good. Man, that's his shot. <laughs> Maybe he was too wide open. Williams passes to White. Outside, Williams. Pass to Smart. White with the steal. And here is DeRozan. Here's the three. White can't hit. He's been tremendous at corralling misses all night long. He has led this team in rebounding and also taken on the role of enforcer. Williams, a screen on White. Smart passes to Williams. And the shot goes in. And the Celtics lead by 13. Like a matador. Olay! There was no defense. That has to be one of the easier shots I've seen tonight. And this is what happens when you start to break your opponent's spirit. The resistance is no longer there. Oh, it's blocked by Williams. To the middle. Ed Williams gets the bucket on the assist from Smart. They just look so overwhelmed inside. Yeah, that's why they continue to get attacked. Chicago making some changes. Jones comes in for DeMar DeRozan. And Green is subbed in for Levine. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Hey guys, Billy Donovan was just reviewing the plan with his team. He's been really discouraged by their effort. He said, quote, it's about want to, fighting through the adversity. Look at yourselves and ask, quote, what can I do to help us win? He's laying down the challenge. Appreciate the report, Allie. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone by in the fourth. White. Good. His quickness is almost unguardable. Kobe White with the nice little floater. Smart passes to Gallinari. With the drive. No good on the shot. And it's Chicago the other way. Here's Caruso. Back to White. Over Smart. And a great job by the D, contesting that shot and forcing the miss. Gallinari with it. Williams with the screen. Pass to Williams. This one for three. Sinks the tray. Williams has got five points in the quarter. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. You know what? They talked about this at halftime. And they're doing a better job of creating space. Clock at six. Back to Drummond. Over Williams. Drummond with the bucket. The Celtics have gotten three of seven attempts in this fourth quarter to fall. Time called here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. Oh, Grant, at this point in his career, I think it's safe to say Andre Drummond will go down as one of the game's premier rebounders. Yeah, you just don't call him a specialist because there's a lot more to Drummond's game than just rebounding. Rim protection, points in the paint. He does just about everything you want in a big man. When he's on the floor, he lightens the load on every other member of their front court. And some changes here for the Celtics. Tatum, he's checked in for Gallinari. Jalen Brown comes in for Williams. And Brogdon is subbed in for White.
Chicago on D. They've allowed just seven points here in the fourth. Inside. Oh, got a piece of it. Outside White. Pass to Green. To the right side. Shot clock at six. Drummond finds White. The three-pointer off the mark. And they're plus five on the boys after that rebound. Williams, a screen on Green. Drummond against Brown. Now here's Smart. He's guarded closely. Over White. Here's Williams. Wow! Now 10 for 10 after that one. He's on fire. All game long, he's been getting to his spots, and the defense has yet to adjust. Drummond with the ball, guarded now by Smart. And Marcus Smart picks up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. Some changes for Chicago. Nikola Vucevic is checked in for Drummond. DeMar DeRozan comes in for Jones. And it's Zach Levine in for Green. DeRozan against Tatum. Vucevic, a screen on Tatum. It's DeRozan with a drive. If you can get a good screen for DeRozan on a pick and roll, more often than not, he'll convert it. Great body control. The Celtics have gotten four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. Williams, a screen on White. Here's Brogdon. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. And the Celtics lead by 16. DeRozan against Tatum. Picked by Vucevic. DeRozan passes to Vucevic. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot. And will go to the line. Horford. He's checked in for Boston. And a change for the Bulls. Ball's checked in. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. That's good from DeRozan. For Boston, they've got five out of ten shots to drop here in the final quarter. Brogdon against White. Brogdon, the pass to Brown. They set the pick. Back to Brogdon. Shot clock at five. No luck on that one. Ooh, excellent D there from Ball. White on the wing. It's stolen by Smart. Here's Brogdon. Rebound by the Bulls. DeRozan's got rebound number seven tonight. Pass the ball. Back to DeRozan. Down low. Here's White. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. Beautiful focus from Kobe White. Powering his way past the defense. You know Kobe White, the former Tar Heel, viewed as a bit What's of a up? combo guard. But what I like, his playmaking skills has improved. That's good from White. Thinking about White's playmaking here. Smitty, he made a big jump between his rookie and sophomore years. Doubled his assist numbers, B.A. He's passed the eye test with how he's moved the ball. It's an area he still has a lot of room to grow. <laughs> and I'm surprised that didn't go down. I mean, I'm sure he is, too. Levine against Smart. Levine passes to Vucevic. And the power finished by Vucevic. Credit the hard work coming back. They're doing their best to steal this game. They've done a great job, but they're not done yet. Gets the three ball to go. I don't know what coach told him at halftime, but he is shooting the lights out right now. Here's Levine for three. Smart with the defensive effort. Great perimeter D. Gave a good shooter absolutely no room to operate. And there's the whistle. They'll pin that one on Nikola Vucevic. That's his first foul of the game. Here's
It's Brown on the wing to the paint. It's tipped. And that's out of bounds. Boston will retain possession. He was all over that pass. That's a cautionary tale. A little bit late there, but you tried to get into your opponent's head. Forced them to go somewhere else with the ball, and he did that. Tatum with it, guarded by Vucevic. And the call will be against Jason Tatum. That's his third foul of the game. And just a great job of getting there first and absorbing the contact. So it's Chicago now. They trail by 11. Tatum against DeRozan. Vucevic, a screen on Smart. Levine. The rebound, Celtics. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Here's Brogdon. Out to Horford. 4 3. It's held in by White. Just not feeling it from beyond the arc. Sometimes that happens. He's trying to shoot his way out of it. Picked by Vucevic. Levine passes to Vucevic. And the power finish by Vucevic. Instinctual pass by Zach Levine. Doesn't hesitate to feed the wide open man. Up top, Brown. Pounded by Ball. Pass to Horford. Six on the shot clock. Looking to get back on track. And he takes it up and lays it in. And the Celtics lead by 11. That's a well-timed, well-coordinated play. Comes right off the pick for the lay-in. And the basket by DeRozan. DeRozan's got seven points here in the quarter. Nice little dribble move there from DeRozan to open up space for the shot. Tatum against DeRozan. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Falls for Tatum. During his rookie year, Jason Tatum battled LeBron in the Eastern Conference Finals. Tatum's been an impact from the moment he joined the league. And so Tatum nails both of them. The Bulls shooting at a 48% clip from the floor. Here's DeRozan. He can't hit that time. Nice D from Tatum. Boston has gone two of six so far in the fourth. High arcing shot. And there's Brogdon with the basket on the assist from Smart. Man, I'll tell you, when you get your floater game going, it's a tremendous weapon. DeRozan outside. And they pick up two. DeRozan's got nine points in the quarter. He's on a roll. Can't let DeRozan get into rhythm. He will torch you all night. Boston shooting 47% since the fourth quarter started. Tatum passes to Brogdon. Back to Tatum. Brown with it. Tatum finds Brown. Late clock. The Celtics got to hurry here. Horford. That one is off. And it's Chicago the other way. One minute left in the final quarter. And the basket by DeRozan. Physical defense, but DeRozan with great focus and great upper body strength. Horford, a screen on DeRozan. Here's Tatum. Ooh, Tatum slams it home. Impressive job by this team. And you really can't discount the impact of this crowd here. They gave the team tremendous energy tonight. The fans were fantastic. It was a true home court advantage. To the middle. And finished off by Tatum. This is what winning is all about. Playing your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end, 
It's another to finish. Outside Brogdon. We see the Celtics taking the W here. A competitive game. You have to feel like this crowd gave them a little extra edge. Yeah, they really fed off the energy. You saw their activity level go up. Just a tremendous performance. For Steve Smith, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, this is Brian Anderson. Thanks for being with us. As we present our New Balance player of the game, Jason Tatum.